Hey guys, welcome back to Web Mentors YouTube channel and you're watching JavaScript series for beginners. Well, in this video, we're going to see about multidimensional array in JavaScript. Now, we know how to create an array. Now, what is multidimensional array? A multidimensional array is nothing but an array of array. Well, let me actually show you what it can be like. Like, let's create another array alert array 2 is equal to 1 2 3 now this is the second array the third array is going to be the array which is going to be multi-dimensional so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to give the array as the value for the third array now I'm going to display it 0 and 0. Here it's going to be 3. Now 0, 0. So 0 is nothing but alert array and 0 the value is this one. So what happens is that it created an array of array. So your first array, the 0th value, is going to be the array alert array. The first value is going to be the alert array 2. So if I want to access 1 in here, so 1, 0. If I want to access 2 in here, it's going to be 1 and 1 in here. So let's actually reload this page. Let's actually close this. Reload this page and it should give me 1 as the alert message. Yeah, 1 is the alert message. So let's actually go back to my first array, which is 0 array. Let's actually get the last value, the third as the value for my alert message. Reload the page and you can see third is the value. So this is how you create multidimensional arrays and access them. So your multidimensional array should be accessed in such a way that you create an index. The index first index is going to have the first level of array, so the first dimension of the array and then the second one is going to be the second dimensional. So it's going to be like x and y value sorry about that it's actually so this value is going to be the x value this value is going to be the y value if you know what is meant by multi-dimension so x and y so alert array 1 so this is going to be the zeroth array of the x value not x value isn't it it's it is yeah okay and alert array 2 is going to be the one value in here so i might be confusing in la array spot but when you try to actually implement this, you will understand what is the difference between a multidimensional array and a basic array. So try to actually implement them. And uh, in case you are trying to access something out of the bound, you know, there's no value called as fourth. So when I refresh it, you will be getting undefined as the value. So undefined is nothing but an object which states that there's nothing with that name, with that index. So you're glad that you got undefined because sometimes you might get end up into an error which is going to be a trouble so make sure that you are checking the array for how many elements are there in it which we will be seeing in the methods of array before that there is one more thing a cool thing in array which we'll be seeing in the next video so keep watching that and uh, thanks for watching this video guys please hit the like button and also the share button to share it with your friends or anyone you think will be benefited by this video and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel subscribers are really important for the channel so please subscribe to the channel and if you have any comments suggestions feedbacks or issues please leave them in the comment section or else you can contact me through the facebook page twitter feed or google plus page you can find the links for them in the description section thank you for watching let's see in the next video keep watching the series